Hopefully you guys are doing good. It's your boy back with another one. Um, sorry if my voice is a little bit hoarse, you guys. I think I'm... Uh, something's going on with my throat. Not feeling the best. Um, but got to make a video for my people out there, man. Um, this is a download that just came to me, guys. And this is about how we have to learn to trust ourselves. And we have to learn... Uh, this is like the root cause of why a lot of people will end up um, not loving themselves, not trusting themselves, and getting into a place to where you get you start feeling depressed. You know, you start getting a lot of like mental health stuff going on, and a lot of it is boiled down to a lot of these little mundane things that we don't think are that important. All right, I want to talk about the importance of doing the things that you know that you need to be doing, doing the things that you say that you're going to do and the magnitude of what that means. Uh, I was just watching my boy, Tim, shout out to you, Tim. Uh, he was talking about how now he has a more profound experience doing the dishes than taking a dose of DMT or psychedelics. And I totally relate with that. Um, basically what Tim was explaining is the fact that, you know, doing things that allow you to trust yourself more are very, very profound. So basically, it's a trust system. You know, there's there's things, there's one category of, of things in life that you know that you should be doing, right? Like, I just wrote down this, this whole list of things that I want to be doing for the next few days. All right, guys, and these are the things that I know that I need to be doing right on a daily basis some of these things i don't do every day right so you know this is a discipline thing i made a video about this uh before you guys to kind of show you but um basically you got to figure out what it is that you know that you should be doing you know for example i got a, i got some things in here that say keep my room clean at all times keep the kitchen clean drink a gallon of water do my breath work make a video per day you know, 90 minutes of, of calls, you know, I do um, solar, I sell solar energy. So <clears throat> I got a couple jobs right now, guys, but you know, there's all these different things run, you know, I've been, I've been running a lot guys, um, almost at the mile, but I, I run 0.8 miles. So I said run 0.8 miles or do my CrossFit before I go to work, right? So these are all goals you guys um but it, it boils down to little things man like what tim was talking about doing the dishes you know keeping your room clean when you when you fail to do these things when you know that it's something that you need to do it's like that little voice inside of your head or the enemy or the devil or whatever that force that's trying to keep you down they win all right so in your subconscious you're basically walking around like a defeated person because you're always getting beat up, you know, by that voice. You guys, it's very, very powerful to do the things that we know that we should do and to do the things that we say that we're going to do. So whether it be, you know, you can bring it, boil it down to really small things, you know, brushing your teeth, you know, get very disciplined. That's why I made that video for you guys about how you can write all this stuff down to really get it dialed in. Do the things that you know you're supposed to do. Brush your teeth in the morning, brush your teeth before bed. Do the dishes. Every time you make food, make sure you do the dishes immediately, right after you do it. Keep your room clean. You know what I mean? Take a shower after work. I know this sounds mundane, but and kind of like really uh, nitpicky, but it's super important to boil it down, you guys, to these little points because you'll forget and then it just stacks up, right? And then you'll end up, you know, being, doing, not doing the things that you know that you need to be doing. All right. So, it was just really profound for me, man, to, to hear that from my buddy Tim when he said that. Um, yeah, it's uh, it's very, very powerful for you to learn how to trust yourself. First, you got to figure out what it is that you know that you should be doing on a daily basis. The second thing you need to do is execute that, you know, because we all have these things and, and we only do them sometimes. You know what I mean? That's how it is. A lot of people just you know, you'll, you'll keep your room clean sometimes, you know, sometimes you'll be, you know, not in the mood to do it. Like, no, that's, that's how that voice ends up winning. You guys is when 
you don't do it every time. When you're on top of it all the time, that's how you stack up these brownie points and these feelings about yourself to where, you know, you can trust yourself, you know, so you're walking around and you feel, you know, like you're a trustworthy person, you know, you're going to love yourself because you know that you're hitting all those areas on a daily basis. So super powerful, man. Little things, doing the dishes, doing your laundry, cleaning your room, cleaning your car, cleaning your kitchen. Cleaning is a big one. Keeping things clean is a very, very important thing. Uh, doing, you know, your, your job at work, you know, making sure that you're giving it your all at your job, right? Going on runs, working out, all these little things, you know that you need to be doing, drinking water. Make sure you're doing that every day, you guys, and making sure that you're on top of it. And don't just brush it under the rug when you decide to miss it. You know, you miss a certain area for the day. You can't just sweep it under the rug. You know, you got to make sure that you're, you know, you take that as like, oh, crap. You know, I forgot to drink water today. You know, that's all these little things are serious. You know, I, I made food. I didn't do the dishes last night. That's serious. That's a serious offense. You know, you got to get to this place where. We're doing it on a daily basis and uh, eventually you just turn into, you know, a very well-rounded individual. So, all right, guys, hopefully you learned something from this man. Learn how to trust yourself and uh, do the things that you know that you're supposed to be doing. All right, boys. Much love. Peace out.